Hey there, there have been an ongoing issue in China regarding new regulations about online games. Basically there are more than 50 rules and most of them are just standard regulations, however, there are new stuffs that were added this time which effectively affect basically most of the famous Chinese games, especially gacha games and online MMORPG games. Here are some of the highlights of the new regulations added. Basically there are more regulations now that are forbidding and restricting anything related to excessive monetizations of gacha games. These policies are seen as a way to curb revenue enhancement strategies by gaming industries which encourages them to necessitate changes in their business models. As a result, Tencent and NetEase stocks had significantly dropped exponentially. Tower of Fantasy Global Publisher is Level Infinite which is basically Tencent's international brand. But the good thing is that these regulations are not yet implemented, instead they are asking players and developers reactions regarding the new regulations. Will this new bill affect Tower of Fantasy? If it is implemented, Tower of Fantasy CN will be affected by it and therefore will undergo some changes to satisfy the regulations, Global may or may not follow the changes made in CN, it's best to wait for further announcements or news from official Tower of Fantasy developers regarding this issue. So it all depends if the Chinese regulations will be implemented or not, as well as how the, the developers will address the regulations in CN. But Tower of Fantasy will still survive for 10 more years according to official developers' notes. Probably.